Yeah. All right. We won the cup in '64. Beat Preston three to two. With goals from Johnny Sissons, Ronnie Boyce, and Jeffers too. And Bobby Moore, he ran the show until the game was won. A barking boy of nineteen years, the king had just begun. Cup winners, cup in '65 to Wembley once again. His fine blonde hair was everywhere. As Bobby ran the game, two goals from Alan Seeley brought the cup to E13. We drank a toast to all the boys and Bobby Moore, the king. And then in 1966, the country made the call. Sir Elfie rang Ron Greenwood. He said, Ron, I need them all. Ron said, Don't be greedy. I'll only give you three. Moro, Erst, and Peters get down to Wembley. Well, Martin Peters scored a goal and Geoffrey Erst scored three. Bobby was the captain when we beat West Germany. Bobby was the general, the leader of the team. When West Ham won the World Cup, and England reigns supreme. His memory will never fade, the greatest in the land. Now Bobby Moore's in heaven, he sits at God's right hand. The finest number six the football world has ever seen. And that's how we'll remember him, Bobby Moore the King.